M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Going to show you Doozy by David PA7LIM on the new ICOM ID50. Nice easy setup. Go to this link that I will provide here on the left, and the images that you can see give you an idea of what happens. The new ICOM ID50 does have a USB C out which will charge the radio but also acts as a serial connection. So just grab any USB cable, there is one in the box. Plug it into your laptop PC and you'll be able to access D-Star, D-Star Plus, Dextra, DCS, XLX and there's lots of uh, instructions here. And this is what it looks like when it's running. So mine is on now, you can hear just in the background there that it's connected so I'm going to show you how. Scroll down here and where it says Doozy, hit the link software PI7LIM and you'll get this window here on the right just behind the radio and I just go and then you click the beta and then doozy you download the zip and you end up with this window here okay now we are, we are connected so I'm just going to disconnect so you've got the connect button here but you've also got the on off button and they do a different item so uh, on the right here so the cable is connected in the PC go right click device manager go to your ports here yeah, just ports double click then you've got USB serial device oh, that's the one you want close that down remember the 18 on mine on yours it will be it will be different then on this window you can quickly let's have a look now click here where you've got your toolbar so it's beneath the donation tab then put in your call sign M0FXB I've put here update host files you may as well do that that gets all your latest connections and I've enabled APRS at the moment because I wanted to try that out see how that works and then you've got 18 there now this will work this this doozy will work with the 52 the 705 it's going to work with the new icon uh, 75 the 70 maybe the 74 not sure about the 74 but definitely the 75 uh, and also <coughs> a couple of other d-star radios so once you've done that click save now hit once you've connect, cut, remember the important thing is selecting com 18 connect no turn it on first ah just realized the radio you need to go menu We'll come out of terminal mode, normal. So that's your normal mode. Let's just come out of everything. So just normal VFO mode. Now look. So we're going to go menu, scroll across until you see DV gateway. Press enter and then terminal mode. And you can do this on the Icon 51 plus 2 as well. Once you've done that, then turn on and then connect. See that? And we're straight away let's turn it up. <clears throat> and so it's green at the moment. If we disconnect, you'll see that we've got DCS, XRF, reflectors, XLX. And then we've got all the reflector numbers. But obviously if you change to say XLX, the numbers change. You'll find that XLX, XRF stuff will get you sometimes into DML or Fusion links. So reflector, we were on 30, connect. So if I transmit, it should go red. It says connected. M0FXB calling for an audio check. Mike Zero Fox X-Ray Bravo. There you are, so it goes red on TX. So with this, you won't need a hotspot. Yeah, hi Adrian, it's Andreas in Western Supermare, and you're sounding really good, nice and clear. I'm on the new ICOM 50 using the Doozy program by PA7LIM. Back to you. Working great, and I will quickly plug it into my 52. Just going through a hotspot and uh, running about um, 
M0FX, but yeah, thanks very much. Yeah, I'm on the the they they brought out a new radio called the ID50, so it's it's basically a 51, and uh, I do still have my 52. But yeah, your audio is working very well, nice and clear. Okay, thanks for the check. I'll just uh, finish off my video and then uh, and catch you later. Back to you for a final M0FXB. Zero FXB, G0RXG, okay, Bye -bye. Nice clear contact. Cheers, thanks very much, 73. And what you'll see is that there's a history here on the right hand side as well. Remember, this is free. Oh, it would be nice if you can donate. Now, if we let's grab my 52, I'll move the 50 out of the way. Put my 52 in. I, I, I have made a video doing this on my 52 and my 705, but while I'm here, I thought, why not? So there's my 52 plugged in. Let's just check that the serial connection. Let's have a go. Device manager hasn't changed. 19 now, and it does. It has selected that it's a 52. So we'll disconnect. Hit the toolbar. Actually, turn it off, toolbar, change to 19, save, turn on, connect. Now you are linked to Reflector Charlie. So that's it, and that's on the, the icon 52, which hopefully you can see. M7LGC. So thanks for watching my channel. Big thanks to P87LIM. Definitely check this out. It's just really good. That's that's it. It's just really good. So um, one of my favorite, one of my favorite links. Bye for now. Seven three. All the best. Please remember to like and subscribe.